twice when I was uh, uh, head of the Guru Kula in Dallas. And we hadn't been in the, the building very long, but um, this one afternoon, this incredible storm came upon the school. In the middle of the day, it turned dark as night, and the wind started howling, and uh, the wind was blowing really hard. After about 15 minutes, it, it blew away, and we went into this internal courtyard of the school, and this huge tree that was there had actually been blown to where it was leaning against one of the buildings that, where we took the shot. And you know, in those days, we were, we were young, um, but we had fairly large responsibilities. And I felt myself capable of making a decision. Uh, I brought someone out to check the tree, a professional, and he told me that the, the roots were not in very good shape and the tree needed to be cut down. So I immediately contracted to have the tree cut down. Several weeks later, Srila Prabhupada arrived and the story was related to him. And um, he immediately wanted to know which fool had made this decision. <laughs> and uh, so I immediately came forward and, and uh, took my, my instructions. And what I learned, not then, but later, was that uh, Prabhupada was the consummate business person. And uh, you know, what my chore should have been was to have gotten two or three different quotes and found the truth rather than just proceed uh, as I did, so. Shiva. <laughs>